Okay, what's up guys? Man, I'm really trying to say that without sounding like Willard. So today, I'm gonna go on a little adventure. Um, I was on another adventure, i.e. trying to teach my teenage daughter how to drive and I noticed something. Um, it's in an area that I don't think I'm supposed to go. It's in a place that I'm not quite sure I'm allowed to go. Uh, but I've got easy enough access to it. So I don't know. But to get there it's going to be a little bit of a, uh, little bit of a walk. Uh, not a bad one. Just on some city streets for the most part. And some abandoned railroad tracks. But uh, it's just too good of a spot to pass up. One thing that's important to remember is if you're going into places that you're not quite sure you're supposed to be in, um, or maybe you're not supposed to be in it, it's important to go in there and not, don't go in there and start destroying stuff. Because you start doing that and you get caught. You know, it goes from, you know, hey, I'm just flying toys around to, you know, hey, I'm in here destroying private property so if you're gonna get punished you're likely to get more you get more punishment when you destroy stuff so don't do that leave places the same or better than you found it it goes for you know the woods wilderness deserts or bandos abandoned spots so I figured Sunday would be the best day to do this. Uh, not only because today is when I seen it. Um, this town's about dead on Sunday. So other than, you know, people going to the 30 million churches that we have. So this will, uh, let's create a little less uh, visibility. And uh, I think it'll be fun to come along. And one thing you don't want to forget, especially when you are going off into the woods or less traveled places, especially in this part of the country, is all right. So now that the bug spray is applied, um, hopefully to keep some of the ticks and chiggers off, but. You just never know. Uh, we can continue our journey on some old, uh, I don't even want to call them railroad tracks anymore. Because they're not. So, we continue our journey.
What the hell is that? <laughs> hey! Scared the piss out of me. All right, and there we have it. So the next part is getting out without getting tetanus. Or spraining your ankle. So I still wasn't sure what that uh, little animal was inside the vent. But, I do know good and well I scared the piss out of it. Alright, thanks for clicking and joining today. Um, if you would, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe and give this uh, video a thumbs up. Um, I try to get out and make videos. Oh, I like to get a video out at least once a week. Um, but as often as possible. So uh, if you keep tuning in, you can hit that little bell if you want to get notified uh, of whenever I post a new video. Thanks for joining. Have a great day.